Hello, how are you? I'm not gonna lie to you, uh, that title is not clickbait. I literally cannot beat this game. I've tried, I don't even know how many times. I've done so many streams, and I've only gotten progressively more angry at the game as it's come out. I have tried this so many times, and I cannot, for the life of me, beat this game. I have tried on stream, I've tried off stream, and it literally just not, it's just not happening. I might come back to this game, I don't know if I want to, but I might, because I feel like I need to beat all the games, but I just physically cannot get past this one bit, and it's driving me insane, so we're just gonna make this video, and then we're gonna keep playing the rest of them. I don't, I don't care. I don't care. Also, I almost forgot. Please go follow me on my Twitch. There's no doubting what you've achieved on a technical level. These are clearly state-of-the-art. There are just certain design choices that were made for these robots that we don't fully understand. We were hoping that you could shed some light on those. She can dance. She can sing. She's equipped with a built-in helium tank for inflating balloons right at her fingertips. She can take song requests. She can even dispense ice cream. With all due respect, those aren't the design choices we were curious about, Mr. Afton. Welcome to the first day of your exciting new career. Whether you were approached at a job fair, read our ad in screws, bolts, and hairpins, or if this is the result of a dare, we welcome you. I will be your personal guide to help you get started. I'm a Model 5 of the Handyman's Robotics and Unit Repair System, but oh, you can call me no. Hand Unit. Your new career promises challenge, intrigue, and endless janitorial opportunities. Please enter your name as seen above the keypad. This cannot be changed later, so please be careful. It seems that you had some trouble with the keypad. I see what bit. you were trying to type, and I will auto-correct it for you. One moment. Welcome, Eggs Benedict. Yep, that's my name. Don't worry at all. All right. You can now open the elevator using that bright, red, and obvious button. Let's get to work. I remember Allow me to fill a somewhat frightening little... silence with some light-hearted banter. Due to the massive success, and even more so the unfortunate closing of Freddy Fazbear's Pizza, it was clear that the stage was set, no pun intended, for another contender in children's entertainment. Unlike most entertainment venues, our robotic entertainers are rented out for private parties during the day, and it's your job to get the robots back in proper working order before the following morning. You are now in the primary control module. It's actually a crawl space between the two front showrooms. Now, let's get started with your daily tasks. View the window to your left. This is the Ballora Gallery party room and dance studio, encouraging kids to get fit and enjoy pizza. Let's turn on the light and see if Ballora is on stage. Press the blue button on the elevated keypad to your left. Uh-oh, it looks like Ballora doesn't feel like dancing. Let's give her some motivation. Press the red button now to administer a controlled shock. Maybe that will put the spring back in her step. Let's check the light again. Excellent. Bellora is feeling like her old self again and will be ready to perform again tomorrow. Now view the window to your right. This is the Funtime Auditorium, where Funtime Foxy encourages kids to play and share. Try the light. Let's see what Funtime Foxy is up to. Looks like Funtime Foxy is taking the day off. Let's motivate Funtime Foxy with a controlled shock. Motivation! Motivation. No. Let's try another control. <laughs> Looks like Funtime Foxy is in perfect working order. Great job. Motivation. In front of you is another vent shaft. Crawl through it to reach the Circus Gallery control module. I don't like this. Motion trigger. Surface gallery vent. Uh, 
Oh, something's gonna get me. Guess not. On the other side of the glass is Circus Baby's auditorium. Let's check the light and see what Baby is up to. Looks like a few of the lights are out, but we can fix that later. Let's encourage Baby to cheer up with a controlled shock. Seems a little cruel, but you know, whoa. Let's try another control shock. Let's try another control shock. Great job, Circus Baby. We knew we could count on you. That concludes your duties I didn't see first her. night on the job. We don't want you to leave overwhelmed. Otherwise, you might not come back. Please leave using the vent behind you, and we'll see you again tomorrow. I didn't see her. Wait, can I check again? She's not there. Oh, that's really good. Oh, no. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, God. God. Ah, oh, the audio. Oh, God. Is the audio good now? Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. No, please come back. Come back, audio, please. Another day, another dramatic entry in the lives of Vlad and his distressed mistress. Where will they go? What will they do? All of that and more happening now. Clara, I tell you, the baby isn't mine. How'd I tell you that it is? You're the only vampire I've ever loved. And the baby turns his bottle into powdered milk. That doesn't mean anything. He sleeps on the ceiling fan. Upright or upside down. What does it matter? You need to be part of your son's life. I'm an old man, Clara. I can't be a father. Well, then at least pay your child support, you deadbeat! Will Vlad and his distressed mistress find common ground? <coughs> Tune in next time. What half sound? Welcome back for another night of intellectual stimulation, pivotal career choices, and self-reflection on past mistakes. We're committed to creating a unique and fulfilling work experience. One part of that commitment is ensuring that you don't get tired of the voice that you're hearing right now. Using the keypad below, please select a new companion voice. It seems that you had some trouble with the keypad. I see what you were trying to type and I will auto-correct it for you. Thank you for choosing Angsty Teen. The elevator stopped. You know the routine. Get out now or whatever. So, funny story. A dead body was found in this vent once. Okay, so not that funny, but it's a story. Okay, let's start with your nightly chores. You should check on Ballora and make sure she's on her stage, but whatever. Huh. I guess Ballora has better things to do. Let's zap her. That should be fun. Let's check on Funtime Foxy. Make sure he's ready for showtime tomorrow. Great. 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 There seems to have been a problem with the voice synthesizer. Default settings have been restored. Please proceed through the vent ahead of you to Circus Baby's auditorium. All right. Seems normal to me. The 
motion trigger, circus gallery vent. Circus Baby had a busy day today. Let's check the light and make sure she's in proper working order. Oh, Circus Baby, we aren't here to play hide and seek. Let's encourage Baby to come out of hiding with a controlled shock. Zap! Oh. Let's try another controlled shock. Zap! There Please. seems to be a oh. power malfunction that is affecting our ability to properly motivate Baby. Please stand by while I reboot the system. I will be offline momentarily during this process. Various other systems may be offline as well, such as security doors, vent locks, and oxygen. Commencing system restart. Motion trigger, entryway vent. Stop it, stop it, stop it, Thunder stop it. Monitorium maintenance vent opened. Ballora Gallery maintenance vent opened. Motion trigger, technician control. I don't recognize you. You are new. I remember this scenario, however. It's a strange thing to want to do, to come here. I'm curious what events would lead a person to want to spend their nights in a place like this. Willingly. Maybe curiosity? Maybe ignorance? There is a space under the desk. Someone before you crafted it into a hiding place, and it worked for him. I recommend that you hurry, though. You will be safe there. Just try not to make eye contact. It will be over soon. They will lose interest. Wait, what does this do? What? What am I meant to do? belong to you it doesn't belong to you it doesn't belong to you it doesn't belong to you give that back what am i meant to do what am i meant to do okay back online, he is going to tell you that he was unsuccessful, that you must restart the system manually. He will then tell you to crawl through Ballora Gallery as fast as you can to reach the breaker room. If you follow his instructions, you will die. Okay. Ballora will not return to her stage anymore. She will catch you. The power will be restored shortly. When you crawl through Ballora Gallery, Go slowly. She cannot see you, and can only listen for your movement. When you hear her music become louder, she is growing near, listening for you. Wait, and be still. Thank you for your patience. It seems that the power system cannot be restarted automatically. You will need to restart the power system manually. Please return to the primary control module as fast as possible as to not disturb Ballora. I will deactivate like myself that. momentarily as to not create an auditory disturbance.
Please proceed as quickly and as quietly as possible. A little terrifying, but we made it. Great job. This completes your tasks for the night. Please proceed back through the Ballora Gallery with care, and we'll see you back here tomorrow. Too easy. Too easy, really. Too easy. Too easy. Too easy. We're too easy. As the sun sets, so also does another chapter in the saga of love lost between Vlad and his distressed mistress. Can they be reconciled? Can their love rise again? That and more happening now. Clara, the baby is in mine. It is Vlad. They had trouble catching him in the nursery today. For what? Lots of kids get hyper and run around and stuff. They had to knock him out of the air with a broom. I have to go. They're going to dock your paycheck. They can't do that. I'm a vampire. I don't need paycheck. You work the graveyard shift at the Primey Taco. <laughs> don't lie to me. Oh, the humanity. When will the heartbreak end? When will these two ships passing in the night rekindle their long lost love? Tune in tomorrow to find out. Okay, I gotta change my batteries real quick. <laughs> Welcome back to another pivotal night of your thriving new career, where you get to really ask yourself, what am I doing with my life? What would my friends say? And most importantly, will I ever see my family again? <laughs> we understand the stresses of a new job, and we're here for you. To help you reach a more stable and relaxing frame of mind, we offer several musical selections to help make this elevator ride as relaxing and therapeutic as possible. We offer contemporary jazz, classical, rainforest ambiance, as well as a wide selection of other choices. Using the keypad below, please type the first few letters of the musical selection you would prefer. Let's get some Cardi. It seems you have some trouble. <laughs> <laughs> I see what you were trying to type, and I will auto-correct it for you. Thank you for selecting... Juice Casual World. Bongos. Oh. <laughs> now that your elevator experience has been customized to your needs, and you're thoroughly relaxed, it's worth mentioning that due to your lackluster performance yesterday, your pay has been decreased by a substantial amount. I did Please fine! Please enjoy the rest of your descent. Oh. One. Nine. Eight. Oh, wait, wait, wait. One. One. Nine. Eight. Three. Enter. Nothing? It gives me nothing? Okay. Worth a shot. You will need to reach the parts and service room on the other side of Funtime Auditorium to perform the procedure yourself. Great. Let's check on Ballora first and make sure she's on her stage. You know she's not. Oh my god. Can I have a look at the... Okay. Great. It looks like everything is as it should be in Ballora Gallery. Let's check on Funtime Foxy. It's important to make sure she's on her stage before entering. Great. It looks like everything is as it should be in Funtime Auditorium. There is no need to check on Baby tonight. Please refrain from entering unauthorized areas. Proceed directly to Funtime Auditorium. All right, I will do that in just a second. Motion activated. For this reason, it's important to keep the room dark, as to not accidentally activate her. You have been provided with a flash beacon. Use it if you need to get your bearings and to ensure you don't bump into anything. 
However, use it as sparingly as possible. Proceed forward to reach the parts and service room. Too easy, really. I'm I'm pretty good at this game. Okay. Parts and service. Great job reaching parts and service. It seems that Funtime Freddy is out of power, which should make your job much easier. The release switch for the chest cavity is located on the underside of the endoskeleton jaw. To reach it, we will first need to open the face plates. You will need to press the face plate release triggers in a specific order and it's important to be as precise and as careful as possible. Locate the small button on Freddy's face, just under his right cheek, and press it. Great! Now locate the button under his left cheek and press it. Great! Now carefully locate and press the button next to Freddy's right eye. Am I not pressing it? Now carefully locate and press the button just above Freddy's nose. It still got me. Still Good scared job. me. The face plates should now be open. <sighs> locate and press the small button on the underside of Freddy's endoskeleton jaw. Excellent. Can't get me twice. The chest cavity Fool me should once. now be open. Shame on Remove you. Remove the power module from the chest cavity. Great work. You will now be required to remove the secondary power module from the Bonnie hand puppet. Great job! You've acquired both power modules. This completes your tasks for the night. Please exit the building through Funtime Auditorium and we'll see you back here again tomorrow. No, please don't make me restart all that. That's so stupid. I literally, he was nowhere. I was doing... What? What just happened? Oh wait, was that supposed to happen? Uh, it was. Shh, be still and quiet. You've been sleeping for quite a while. I think they noticed that you never left the building last night. The cameras were searching for you, but they couldn't find you. I have you hidden too well. I kidnapped you. <laughs> I'll open the face plates for you. Is wait. I'd recommend that you keep the spring locks wound up. Your breathing and your heartbeat are causing them to come loose. You don't want them to get too loose. Trust me. Yeah, not a fan of that. What are, what are you? What am I meant to do about little things? Uh, what am I meant to do at the end of the day? It doesn't make any sense, does it? Dude. What? Wow! 
What? Oh my god, this is so dumb. What got me? I can't focus on all of them. It's so stupid. Oh my god. It's so stupid. This is not... It's not doable on console. It's not even, like... With the amount of precision it takes for PC... And you see these people saying, oh, you have to set up a timer and nail this with maximum precision. How are you meant to do this on console, dude? I mean, looked over at that side. Yep. I'm done. I'm done with this stupid game. I'm, I'm, it's over. I'll, I'll continue this later. This is so infuriating.